Tell me a bit more about Becky. What was Becky like? She was just perfect, feisty, funny. She could make like a good situation out of anything bad. She'd always make you laugh as well. Mm. How have you tried to get through the last nine months? What's it been like for you? And how have you managed to deal with it? I've just tried doing everything for her, really. I mean, anything I've done or me and my mum's done has just been for, like, strictly for her. Uh, still don't really seem real. Just nine months of just like emptiness, really. You grew up with Nathan. Yeah. Um, what's your reaction to the prison sentences that they got? Life with him, but minimum 33 years, 17 years for Shauna. Still not enough for him or her. Do you think he should ever be released from prison? No. Why not? Because he wouldn't be safe right now. Like teenagers or anyone. There'd be 61 when he gets out and there'd still be looking for teenagers because it's gone in that. Tell me a little bit more about... Becky and Nathan, what was their relationship like? Did you ever have any suspicions? No, when I would, like, when I was living there, when I'd go there, like, from my mum's, it would just be, like, brother and sister, like, playing, like, play fighting or joking about or something. But I never knew, like, the way he was thinking and stuff in his head. Obviously, I would see them, like, joking about and it was like a love-hate relationship type thing. But I never clocked on to what was going on now. What do you, when you think about him now, how do you see him when you think about growing up with him? Animal. Just complete animal. But, like, obviously he never showed that side to me when I was younger. Just betrayal from him is unbelievable. What for you would mean justice for Becky? Him dead. Or throw him in a room with like our family and then watch what happens.